This event is designed if you know nothing, you're going to learn something. If you know a little bit, you're going to learn a little bit more. And if you're somebody who's been doing that code of work for quite some time, this is going to be all for you. Co-occurring disorders, the combination of one or more mental health challenges and substance misuse, drug and or alcohol. We want to increase the likelihood that those already impacted will seek help. We want to create a generation with no stigma related to these topics. And we want to create youth representatives who are truly the agents of change. It is so inspiring to know that such a large group of young people are here who understand the importance of getting involved, advocating for better treatment practices, and staying active in our communities. This is a collaborative effort to really mobilize our young people around something that maybe they've never heard of. Even though we're in this virtual space, you have such incredible power to make really lasting change. The Harris Project has given me opportunities ranging from spreading awareness to fellow classmates to testifying at an OASIS and the New York Office of Mental Health sessions. The work that Stephanie and the Harris Project have done on co-occurring disorders is really amazing. I wish that there was something like that when I was growing up. We don't just approach it from the provider, you know, we're doing treatment boys. We bring it to the table from every single level. And that's what I think makes our advocacy so effective. We see creativity and enthusiasm that comes out of this event, and that's very, very important. There's going to be a lot of polling, a lot of interactive opportunities. Can everybody wave hello to us real quick? I see you guys. We've got football games coming up in Somers and White Plains and New Rochelle and in Lakelands. We got a grant during this whole pandemic from WMC Health, and part of that funding allowed us to create tiles that literally helped us bring co-occurring disorders out of the shadows and into the light. Cornell, do you mind leading the crowd in a little four square breathing? Breathe in through your nose. Two, three, four. How are you feeling, Stephanie? Thank you Stephanie? so much, Cornell. I'm, I'm feeling more relaxed just by doing this. <laughs> this right here, it, it touches my heart and I'm, I'm super happy to be a part of it. This I feel is so much close. Race. I know. Ooh, I see the winner. The winner is Coda Games. Thank you so, so much for being part of our event. <laughs> um, we're really looking forward to keeping in touch with you. Good night, everybody, and thanks so much for joining us for the 2021 Coda Virtual Youth Summit. <laughs>